All right, I'm gonna throw some lube all up in here. You can throw a lot of lube in here if you want. I think it matters. What's weird about the Cummins is that these inner, inner ones don't have bearings. You can get bearings pressed in or milled out and machined and you can get bearings put in there. But uh, machine shops charge a lot. I think I, when I asked the machine shop, he basically said no, he doesn't even do it. Just because he's lazy, he doesn't want to do it. Um, the reason I know that is because some guy came in while I was there paying for it and asked him if if he does something for uh, the guy was looking to get some injectors or something machined and uh, the guy ended up telling me that oh, geez, that's a lot. he ended up telling me the owner was just all yeah I usually tell people that I don't do it if I I don't want to do it so I'm just putting some junk on these tappets So, anyway, I don't really got any more, anything else to say, which is why I don't like doing these videos, because they're boring for you and me. Okay, I'm going to go get the can, slap it in. move the camera so I'm gonna try to one hand it try to go in as straight as you can just rest it on its lobes Lobe. This thing isn't light. It's hard to grab back here. So this is where I see everybody fighting and hitting it and pushing it and blah 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 anyway so that's the cam install um pretty much pretty much it needs to figure out what bolts it gets because i don't remember but apparently they go Just like that. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I think this is part three. So this is the cam install, tap it install, and everything else. I'm going to go in and eat. I'm going to try to do uh, the crank next. Got the camera. So I'm going to try to install the crank bearings everything uh, same process the lube everything except for this thing weighs I think it weighs a good hundred pounds 110 pounds if I remember right so yeah anyway um, I'm gonna go eat some something clean up a little bit and uh, that's it so that's the uh, the cam install nozzles so cam, nozzles, main studs, and head studs are basically ready to go in once uh, once I get the bottom all buttoned up and everything done on the bottom end 
flip it over, I'll put the head studs on, and uh, yeah, go from there. So, alright guys, thanks for watching. Make sure you guys comment below, give me a like, hit the bell notification over here, subscribe, check out my boy One in Glen. Oh, I guess it's the wrong way. Anyway, and uh, watch my previous video. Alright guys, later.